So I just got an LCP. I have had for three or four years a kel p P3AT, which I love, carry it. 90% of the time that I'm carrying a gun, this is what I'm carrying, probably actually even 95%. This is a great, compact, totally works. It's hot, it's loaded, I was carrying it today. But let's look at the LCP as it comes from the box. I paid $199 for this um, from Palmetto State Armory. And um, after tax and transfer, eh, it's 250 ish dollars. Anyways, read and inspect. Manual. Here's the gun. Shell casing. Uh, soft case. And extra base plate. Magazine. Again, lawyers run Ruger, so it says, hey, you got no fire if you, even if you don't put this in nice annoying sticker that comes up your magazine. Why does Ruger number all these holes? Are they like under the impression that I can't count? I don't understand that. Uh, big old nasty lock. Firearm itself. Comes in a bag. It's a flag. And that. Let's go ahead and open this up. The nice thing about this gun versus the kel -Tec is that it has a slide hold open. Now, it won't lock open on an empty mag, but you can hold it open for loading or for whatever. Uh, so as we can see, this is a fully unloaded firearm. And uh, we're just gonna take a moment with the trigger here. I'd like you to look right here at the back. You can pull back and it's all a very quick snap. The kel -Tec, you can kind of stage the back of the gun, but this is basically, you pull it back, and there's really not, it just kind of falls real quick, and it's real heavy as you try to stage it, but that's the unboxing of a uh, LCP.